Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wonderful people. Thank you for your love. Thank you for your support. Thank you for following our channel. Thank you for your subscription. Uh, today I will bring to you another Obonga news where they happen. This one is on Simon Epa and Charlie Boy's exposure. Charlie Boy reviews Simon Epa's alleged connection with the APC-led government. Uh, Charlie Boy, the singer, also the artist, and also Wonder Man has reviewed Marzi Simon Eba's connection with the APC-led government. It has happened again. <laughs> it looks like um, Charlie Boy has gotten something tipsy, um, a very deep secret about Simon Eba, maybe what Simon Eba has been hiding uh, for such a long time. But as it stands now, it looks as if someone like Charlie Boy has something to say. Let's go into the the information proper and the secret that Charlie Boy has just reviewed about Simon Eber, who is the Biafra activist and also the self-acclaimed disciple of Mazi Nam the Kano. Famous Nigerian singer and activist Charles Oputa, better known by his stage name, Charlie Boy has alleged that Simon Eber, the de facto leader of the outlawed indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, is working for all Progressive Congress, APC. Charlie Boy also claimed that Eba's athletic career was sponsored by late Deji Tinobu. In his statement contained in a post via his verified Twitter handle on Wednesday, Charlie Boy said Eba works for APC and that he is being used to destabilize the Southeast. He further reviewed that the Finnish based Nigerian represented Lagos State in athletic competition. He wrote, Do you know that Rascal Simon Eba? Will they lead a fraction of IPOB? Do you know he has very strong connection with APC? Do you know that it was the late Deji Tinubu that sponsored Simon Eba's athletic career and sent him abroad? Do you know that Simon Eba represented Lagos State? This Nayo 2 plus 2. <laughs> Simon Eba works for APC used to destabilize the southeast what apc cannot do does not exist master planners and regards of all time he wrote <laughs> ah this seems to be very amazing uh, what charles oputa is revealing today i'm um, saying that the most popular and our popular simon eba is working for the apc led government um this is um, very revealing and it is very surprising uh, to anyone that we hear such a thing uh, because you know that um, Simon Eber has amassed uh, many followers and recently he, his channel was also affected on YouTube because of um, various sit at home order that he has been placing and um, but as he stands now it looks as if he's going another way and even that he's another way many people are also following on other channels that uh, Master Simon Eber is also managing, but how um Charles Oputa, the the man Charlie Boy, the big stage man, uh, the Wonder Man, the everyday uh, fresh man, man when they get old, even at this old age, happens to get uh, this relevant information. Um, I'm still surprised as I see at it as you are also surprised look at let me read some of his comments again he said he wrote do you know that the rascal simon eber where they lived a fraction i said do you know him do you know he has a strong connection with the apc government <laughs> so this is a big big secret and then we are here to ascertain how you know, true this thing is. Uh, but if at the end of everything um, this happens to be true, uh, you know that uh, Simon Eber must have misled many people. Is If what he is doing is political and what he's doing is to try to destabilize the southeastern part of Nigeria and for them not to be um, in, in one basket, and that is very wrong of Eber. But this is um, Charles Oputa's opinion, uh, Charlie Boy, uh, the, the 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 real fact or the truth behind this um uh, talk has not yet come out or should i call it an an accusation that uh, the big simon eber the whole simon eber the greatest activist of all time and um, a man who many biafrans 
or many Igbos or, or those from the south eastern part of Nigeria and the south south have come to believe in is working for a political group known as the APC. Of course, you know that APC is the led government in Nigeria now, the all progressive uh, Congress. And um, he said that Deji Tunubu, who who was um, the nephew of Bola Ahmed Tinubu Aswaju, who is the current president elect now, was the one who sponsored Eba, uh, sponsored Eba's athletic career. Uh, because you know, once upon a time, Eba represented the Lagos State in his athletic career. And because of uh, his uh, attitude and actions and his uh, specialty, he was supported by Deji Tinubu, who helped his career and he was able to leave, leave Nigeria. But now he is now a Finnish citizen. That's Finland citizen. That is where he does uh, most of his broadcast. And recently, remember that Simon Eber tried to introduce a Nigerian currency in exile and also Biafra government in exile. Of course, he said that uh, the Biafra government in exile will have his passport, have everything, every um, diplomatic uh, properties that belongs to a sovereign government. Uh, but some people came out, people like Emma Powerful, and said that they are not in what Simon Eber is doing. So if you compare what is actually happening in the and the um, um the IPOB family, whereby uh, Simon Eba and the other IPOB family does not stand in one place. It looks as if Simon Eba is another business, and the IPOB family are another business. The other time they came out and disowned Simon Eba, uh, saying that whatever Simon Eba is doing does not consign them. That happened when Eba introduced the uh, Biafra currency in exile. And Emma Powerful came out and wrote on the news. He said that whatever that Eba is doing, that IPOB disassociates themselves from it because you cannot have a currency while you are still in another country. And the same thing happened when Emma Simon Eba established Biafra government in Ezra. Of course, recently there was a picture of their address in the united states of america where they established an embassy or should i call it an office where they do their biafra uh, government in exile but the ipob members say that they are not part of what EPA is doing so if you look at the whole thing somehow to me it is very confusing because one is yet to ascertain whether uh, EPA is working in the favor of the dos or in the favor of the IPOB, or he's doing his own private business. Well, be sure, Eba has many followers. He has uh, many Biafrans who believe in him. And many of them believe that uh, Mazi uh, and the Kano anointed Simon Eba to take over from him. And they, of course, you know that Eba is the action man. He is the man that usually takes the action. He takes no, he does not take no for an answer. He always goes straight to be able to achieve um, whatever he wants to achieve. When he talked about the Biafra currency, he moved ahead to do that. And when also he talked about the Biafra government in Ezra, which they call the autopilot, they moved ahead to achieve that. So Eba is this man that does not take no for an answer. And here, uh, Charles Oputa Charlie Boy has come you know, up with this talk that uh, Eba is working for the APC-led government. And he said, Charlie Boy said that uh, that APC, they are the rigas of all time, the mastermanders of all rigas, the rigas of all rigas, and also uh, that what APC cannot do does not exist. So if this happens to be true, then I will say that um, if um, Charlie Boy calls APC masterminders of all rigas, and what they do does not do does not exist. Uh, it means that the APC-led government can actually do anything in order to achieve what they want to achieve. Uh, but we keep waiting. Just keep your ears on the ground because uh, a talk like this can never be swept under the carpet. It can never, never be swept uh, under the carpet because it is a serious matter and many people's life are involved the life of the Biafrans are involved. The life of Simon Eba is also involved. The life of the DOS are involved. And also the APC-led government are also involved. So I believe that the truth behind this matter, uh, what Charles Oputa, uh, popularly known as Charlie Boy, has spoken, uh, will come to limelight. One day, 
if Eba is also is actually working for the APC government, it will be reviewed. And he, if he is working also for the betterment and the good of the beer France, that will be reviewed also. Just remember that you are on the Emissary News where we bring you the top most of the top news where they happen all over the world. Um, if this is your first time of joining us on this channel, don't forget to like, don't forget to comment, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to share, don't forget to on notification button so that whenever our news enter, I'm um, now you could be the first one collector. Maya, God bless you for listening. Thank you.